What's up guys, got another Hudson air rifle. This one is very different also. This is level action stuff I need to fill up the rifle. And this is the PCP rifle. Boom. So anyways, there is a sight. Pretty cool, easily adjustable with the hand screw. What else we have here? It uh, looks like we're gonna refill it right here. And the lever action, that's it. Right now it's empty. Obviously I'm not holding it that super comfortable and it is very very easy. So anyways, let's fill it up and see what it's all about. It's kind of lame too with Hudson that you have to unscrew and screw this piece on because with the other rifle I have seen that it's easy plug-in. These Hudsons don't have that. And this is what I'm talking about it. You see one of those things that's supposed to be easy to put it on and off. Well, this one doesn't have that. So we'll have to unscrew this whole thing and waste a bunch of time. Hudson really need to get the plug as well. Let's plug it in and fill it up. This plug will come off. And let's turn it on. On. On green, we're gonna turn it off. This thing been an amazing investment, that's for sure. Okay, don't forget to release the air, and then you can take it off easily and plug it in. Safety off and on, cool. What else we got here? This is quite comfortable, I'll tell you what, but we'll see you actually shooting. It says it here 22 caliber made in turkey this is the 22 caliber nothing too big let's load them up so looks like uh, in my last video with the shorty i think i loaded the wrong way you want to put it this way i read the description but not fully so i was doing it this way in from here that's not how you want to do it but oh well we'll make mistakes right that's how we learn That video I already posted, but I just realized that with this gun, because it has same magazine. So that's how you want to load all the Hutsman. Okay, and then spin it back around, and it's ready to shoot. Okay, to load it, you have to open this up. You see nothing isn't here. And just grab one of your magazines. I only have two, but that's a lot better than one. So then slide it in like that. Super simple. And then close it okay uh, the sights obviously it hasn't been sighted in but that's pretty cool sights okay safety off wow it should sight in the middle I can't believe it one thing I see the muzzle break is super cool I uh, hopefully you guys can see the actual the air coming out from both sides so cool i definitely need to practice with my lever action skill probably going to buy a real one this is a lot of fun this is so right on target Whoever used the rifle for a bit knew what they were doing. Also, I kind of see how much ammo I have left. Looks like it's out whenever it gets stuck. That's kind of cool. With the semi auto, you don't even know if it's out or not. Looks like out of 12 shots, we lost uh, 100 bar. So that's kind of cool, 24 shots, but that's 22, that's why it doesn't take as much air. So two magazines and you have to reload or you have to shoot on yellow. But with yellow it's not powerful as it is shoots on green. So yeah, this is why it only comes with two magazines, because every two magazines you have to refill it with air. Okay, let's see what I've done. Again, I was shooting it right in the middle of it, those sights are really cool. Obviously, I'm bobbing up and down because I'm hand-handling it, and look at that. 
all these are 22 very very powerful and the grouping is very very nice you see most of them ride in one line my fault these two but yeah that's amazing as you can see with other rifles I'm way off and I usually try to aim in the middle but yeah very good rifle also something very different about this rifle this thing gets stuck whenever it's empty because it blocks it so you cannot change it anymore that way you're not wasting any more uh, air and also it lets you know that okay you're out of ammo time to reload okay reload very easy I wouldn't get more than two magazines because we don't even need that many let me show you that level action real quick Okay, that's six shot. Let me give you a little bit different view one more time of the actual level action right here. Give you a little close up of that because it's pretty unique. I love the sights on this rifle. You see how it works? And that's it. Once it's out, it blocks it. Super cool out okay this time i was actually focusing more on speed and shooting it so went a little bit to the side as you can see kind of way more out because i was shooting it a little bit more fast to show you how level action works there you go guys beautiful air rifle for sure i really love the muzzle brake on it looks mean and actually i could see the air coming out from the sides um, we are at the hundred. Come on, camera focus. They go a little bit over the yellow. So yeah, it's time to reload it because it's not going to be as powerful. You probably can do one more magazine, but it's way better shoots when it's on green. So shoots only two magazines, then you have to reload it. That's kind of annoying, but okay. You can put tripod over here. I have a tripod. Pretty awesome. The sights. Let me show you. You see you have these two circle sides, front and back. It's kind of cool sights, I never shot with sights like that before. A lot of fun for sure. There you go, camera finally focus where I'm on it. There you go. Super cool, so you match it up, two circles. Anyway, level action, Hudson, 22 caliber PCP. Thumbs up for me, that one is definitely a keeper. Got it here, another Hudson, but this one is pretty unique. Also bought it from Amazon. And this is a 22 caliber, but somewhat looks like a pistol with a stock. Check this out. This is super cool. Also, it's PCP, so we'll need a very expensive $500 air compressor. I guess it's not that expensive. And I like it because you can refill it every time. And one time you paid for the air compressor, you don't have to keep buying the CO2 tank. So PCP is actually pretty nice. All we have to do is just slide it in like that pretty simple very unique air rifle right here and then just let it down and of course hopefully this is semi-automatic so let's start to aim it safety i think i'm hitting the plate yeah i'm still hitting the plate Turn to aim in the middle. Wow, that was fast. I can't believe it. So the coolest part about it, because it came with a few magazines. Um, looks like we gotta put it to the side like that. And I can just take another magazine and shoot. But first, now that it's on safety and without a magazine, let's go look at it where I shot. I was shooting sitting down. I feel like I hit a lot of them in the bag. And you don't even hit a lot of them onto the target. I think first couple, one, two, three, four, and I feel like I went up a little bit. So that's cool. Let's try to aim a little bit lower, but this time I'm going to be standing up without the uh, rifle stand, just with the pistol. Looks like it's only 12 shot. I mean only, that's already a lot. Is it to reload? By the way, how much bar we took away? Oh my gosh, from this... Um, 12 shots 
we got rid of 50 bar okay I said I'm gonna actually take this off and shoot it like that with two hands hopefully oh it's pretty wobbly let's try it like that with the hand like a pistol of the safety what happened looks like I didn't charge it okay now it's, now it's hot I can see how many shots I have and I think I'm all out of shots guess what guys two magazines and this rifle is almost empty I feel like I can do two more magazines and it will be completely empty I'll tell you what a bit too heavy for the pistol if anything I'd use this like that with two hands that's kind of okay but with the stock it's obviously easier to shoot but we all know why we want to shorty sometimes too pretty unique 22 PPC rifle.